guys, this is a FAST exam that was done on May 5th by myself and the internal medicine resident. So this patient had fallen approximately 20 feet out of a tree and was complaining of some chest pain, right shoulder pain, back pain, and he was placed in a regular ED room and was picked up again by the internal medicine resident. So we did a FAST exam together, the patient's hemodynamically stable. We can see here in the left upper quadrant the diaphragm and the spleen right here and the kidney. You can see this patient's a little bit tachypnic, but we can tell that there's no free fluid visible in that quadrant. And then we viewed the right upper quadrant. You can see scanning through your kidney there and your liver right here. We can see the thorax on that side. We don't see a big hemothorax. This is actually your psoas muscle back here, which is part of the retroperitoneum, so you shouldn't see any free fluid back there. But also visualizing Morrison's pouch there and the inferior pole of the right kidney, which is the pericolic gutter. And that all looks negative as well. We also took a quick view of the patient's heart, and you can see in the sub xiphoid view here, you can make out the pericardium, and there is no pericardial effusion. We got a pelvic view that I don't have included on here, but that was also negative for free fluid. And then we went up to the right side of the chest, looking in the midclavicular line about the second intercostal space, and you can make out a rib right here and right here, and here's your pleural line in between, and we don't see any lung sliding in that view. And just to double check with the left side, which is asymptomatic, we went to the left side here and you can see the pleural line sliding back and forth as the patient breathes. And they call that like an ants marching or shimmering view. So it's always good to compare to the asymptomatic side and then go back to the symptomatic side where we can see here that there is no lung sliding. So we did diagnose a pneumothorax in this patient who had fallen approximately 20 feet out of a tree who had an otherwise negative FAST exam and he ended up getting a chest tube.